Breast milk is considered liquid gold, a way to give needed nutrients to infants, especially those who are really, really sick in neonatal intensive care units, NICUs across our state. Similar to blood banks, there are human donor milk banks that help. The problem, not every hospital has access because that liquid gold costs. Proposed legislation could help ease that in Florida. Milk depots collect donated breast milk. It's shipped to the nonprofit Mother's Milk Bank of Florida, where it's pasteurized. It's then bottled frozen and sent back to hospitals. According to the Milk Bank, there is an equity issue between rural and urban communities. They say right now many rural hospitals cannot afford the donor breast milk. Legislation in the Florida House and Senate would allow Medicaid to reimburse hospitals as well as families who provide at-home care for prescribed donor milk so they can afford it for the most medically fragile babies. The nonprofit also says in our state there's been an increase in demand since May of 2021 due to preterm births likely linked to COVID related birth complications. They say while the demand has started to decrease, it's still higher than normal and they will be opening more milk depots across the state. We have several in Tampa Bay where you can donate your breast milk and you can learn more about how to do that, where to do that and the proposed legislation. Head to this story on 10tampabay.com.